Hello and what's up everyone, Thunderbob here, and I am continuing my playthrough of Resident Evil 4 VR. Picking up right where I left off in that last episode. Ashley is still stuck down there. Luis, not doing so hot. And I got some stuff on the ground. I think there's a boss fight here, isn't there? Like he comes out and you gotta fight him. Like that seems vaguely familiar. I feel like I don't want to go down there just yet. Yeah, I can't leave her behind. I can't remember if I can go over this way or not. Again, I played through this, but it's been a couple of years. Yeah, so. I'm pretty sure he's gonna pop out. But before I do that, let's just check out. What I'm packing. Got that rocket launcher, which you can buy more of these. You can use this here, or you can save it, I remember, and makes one of the later fights a bit easier. I got the rifle, I got the TMP, upgraded to 50 ammo. Max damage on these two so far, and I started up the damage here. I haven't really touched the shotgun yet, because I'm going to upgrade the other one later. Yeah, not too bad a, too bad a spot. I should probably put one of you there, because that one will give me more health. And then hand grenades. Yeah, I guess we'll use... Uh... I don't remember what's good for this guy. I think there's a boss fight. It's been so long. But I want to say, like, a big thing pops out here. Right? I could be misremembering this completely. And then I think... Yeah, so if I wanted to sell stuff and whatnot, I should probably just do a quick over right here. With all the pickup and stuff, so if I die, you don't have to start over. I think I get everything. I think I leveled up everything just before this, so. Do I break her out? I can't remember. Yeah. Don't move. Talk about near death experience. Ashley, get out of there. Go ahead, so go ahead, so go ahead. I just died. I think he plays Ashley maybe before the boss fight. I don't think about it. Alright, now you catch me, because I'm always one to catch on you. Shoddy here. Go ahead, oh, I shot that out of the air. Like a 
bounce the wrong way? I got the key! I can get out! Where do you get the key from? Oh, the red guy probably. Now playing okay, you do play Vashley. I totally I thought that was a thing. Let's save this as uh, I'm a little too far into my room. I, I remember there was a section you play as her. I don't remember anything about it. So this is going to be new to me. Thinking you want to be quiet. Go ahead, Luke. Or you just got to avoid them. Morning it's kind of creepy when, Morning like, you can't do anything to fight them? Oh no, he's running. Okay. It's almost like a puzzle. Can I jump over these? Okay. Matalo. Let's see if I can get them together. Go ahead, lo. Go ahead, lo. Go ahead, lo. Go ahead, lo. Muere, muere. Come on. Muere. Oh, I got a little too close there. Jesus. She does not like that. I can't see. I can totally just walk through this stuff. Dude looks like he's like, what the fuck is going on? Can I stomp on him? No. So I gotta get something first. Which I'm guessing is over there. 
This definitely feels like an old school Resident Evil puzzle. What did this one do? Here though. Money, money, money. I think that's it. Do I have the treasure map over here? Okay, so there's nothing. I feel so weak. He stood to mowing through with a sword. Waiting for them to like try to stab me. me too. This is a little imprecise. Okay. Hmm. I was always bad at these puzzles as a kid. That needs to go on that side. Actually, it's just that one. Well. So close. I need that one there, and I'm done.
took slightly longer than it should have. I'm still definitely loving this game, though the more I play it, I'm definitely, I feel like I'm reminded that like it kind of outlasts its, its welcome just a little bit. like. Oh, damn it. Um, it drags on a little bit too much in some sections. Like, I think this was definitely the longest Resident Evil. Like during this time, like one, two, even three was you know five to ten hours long, and then this one came around, it was like fifteen to twenty. And I feel like they didn't expand. I mean, it was a totally different type of game. This is way more of an action game than the survival horror. I feel like some of these areas are just a little too big. Like the beginning areas are just about perfect. But I remember like the castle and especially later, um, there's the area where you're like in their village and the helicopter overhead. And it's like, can this area just end? And... Leon! Ashley! Oh, you did good. I'm sorry if I was... Oh, don't worry about it. Come on. Let's move on. Okay. You ever see some items? Okay. It's still one of my favorite games of all time. Like, I'm not... Can I not combine stuff? Okay, I can't. Okay. But, uh... I feel like it drags. Oh, it's a chapter end. Okay, well that was simple. There's one more thing I'm gonna go do though. And you know, now that I have Ashley, I can go back and get that shotgun. There was a there's a little secret, but you need two people. What a touching mo- All spoiled thanks to your interruption. Why don't you do us all a favor and leave before the audience gets pissed off? You're nothing but an extra in my script. Your biggest scene. I don't ever remember being a part of your- Well then, why don't you screw your- Okay. Uh, where am I? All I'm gonna go do is go and grab the shotgun, which is way over here. So first floor, across, down, up. Shotgun should be there. Let's see. To transport cart. I'm not ready to do this part yet, I don't think. Because I want to say this, like, takes you to the next. That cart takes you way out there. Before I do that, I think I need to go get the, the shoddy. That'll be the end of this video. And then I'll pick it up next time. Let's go.
to remember how to get down there. Oops. There's no need to go back. Well, how do I get the shotgun? I need to go, okay, you can go through. That's where it is. I'm not even looking at the right floor, am I? Let's see. I should probably sell my current shoddy. Got a selection of good things. What are you selling? Is that all, stranger? <laughs> so make Thank room you. For it. Okay, so yeah, I'm going the right way. Be a little disorienting. Matalo. Ah, oh, there's more guys here. These guys came back. Dude over there. Run through. So that goes what to the hedge maze. I think I can go this way though. I love how you go like inside, outside, like... Okay. I think I boost her if I remember right. Broken butterfly. Why did I think you got the shotgun here? Let's see, is there any? There's stars on the map. Missed something over there, but I think. I haven't gone through there yet. That's like, I think the next area I go to. God, there's so much to this area. Something over there, there's something there. Not a lot left and I've got like so much stuff on me. Unless it's a weapon, that's the only thing I really don't want to miss. Yeah, so that's where I was. So that's where I'll be going next. And then there's that ride, which takes you back to the front. And then I think from there you go on this thing and then I'll go through there, which I haven't gone through yet. I don't believe. 
Yeah. Okay. So most of the stuff I missed, I've actually I'll still still check it out here before long. Okay. Well, now that I got this, I think I'll end the video here. Uh, I'll pick it up on that minecart ride and on the little secret area over there. And uh, yeah, if you've enjoyed this, uh, I've got a whole playthrough on the channel. Um, and uh, I've got a ton of other VR content. Feel free to check it out. And if you like it, why don't you consider subscribing? I would definitely appreciate it. Again, thank you for watching, everyone. And have a good night.